civil engineers right now whatever you are able to see is a cantilever beam right we studied this in engineering but here is a practical application of that so what is happening so this becomes your fixed end right so this is my fixed end and this is my free end now why is that you can see there is a decrease in the depth here and you can see over there there is an increase in the depth what is the reason behind that so if you try to plot the bending moment and the shear force diagram of this so your shear force is maximum near the ends and your shear force is minimum near the free end so whenever your shear force itself is minimum there is no point in giving complete depth of the beam so what we did in order to reduce the cost and in order to make it look good what we do is we reduce the depth here and there we increase the depth i mean that is a real depth what is required but this depth we are going to reduce so that what is going to happen we are going to save the concrete and it's going to look good and also the main reason is about the bending moment and the shear force actually the reason is shear force bending moment comes into play if you see the reinforcement here the reinforcement will be maximum near the support whereas near the ends no your reinforcement will be less again for the very same reason of bending moment and shear force